Welcome to Real Time Studios, Mixing Room East. I'm your producer, V. Vanson, and today I'm going to teach you a little bit. All right, of the first thing you want to do tips. is find a word that you would like to expand or modify. So that's what we're going to do real quick. I bet any amount of money, money, I keep it good in this bitch, in this bitch. Uh, I bet any amount of money, money, he ain't busting for shit, for shit. Uh, all right, so I found a little spot right here that I can work on. I would like to change that word, that um. All right, so what I'm going to do now, what do you do is you come over to this little, it's this little sign right here. You click this, and you're going to go down to monophonic. All right, now you see monophonic right there? Monophonic, however you want to pronounce it. You click, it's the third one. Click that. And then you're going to see it go active. That mean that it's on. <clears throat> then it should be on waveform. You're going to click, just in case you didn't see that, right here it says waveform. You're going to click waveform and go to warp. And you'll know if you've done it right because it, the region should turn gray. All right, now you see my region is gray. What I'm going to do is I'm using T right now to expand. R and T expands. And shortens your session, so you want to just do do that with the uh, click. But anyway, so you use the key control. Control drops the anchor in. So you see that that's the anchor. So I like to put one before, one before the region that I'm about to work with, or the waveform I'm about to work with. So right here, control, control, and then I'm gonna throw another one at the end of it. Now what it should do is when you click these it drags it out now what you don't want to do is this you see that you see that red that's that's no good that mean that it's distortion is it's not gonna work so you want to find a nice little median of so about right here I think that should work and then you listen to it see if it works for you yeah. see now I'm Command Z so you can see what it looked like before. That's what it looked like before. So you see I stretched it out. So this is that's that's the regular, and this is what I'm going to leave it at. So I'm gonna bring it to about like right here to the next word. And what it does is it fills it in. So you can go through your song and you can put this wherever you want on words that you might have said too quick or you didn't say. Or said too long, you can shorten it. It works the same way. You can you can shorten it. You can make it quicker. It, it just it goes both ways. So what I'm gonna do right now, in order to keep this, what you have to do is come right back to this to that person, to that little I mean to that little symbol. Now you have it on monophonic. What you want to do is put none. Once you put none, you're gonna get the keys. I mean the prompt to either revert. That means go back, cancel or commit so right now I'm gonna commit because and then the waveform goes back to original state but what you're left with is a different oh shit. Oh shit. Uh, and that's how you do that